Hello and welcome back to Crap. <laughs> a, trap's tale. a trap's tale. My life as a maiden. God damn. All I can ever think of is a trap's tale. I think this game is sucking us dry in a way, but <laughs> it's just too good. I keep forgetting its name because ever ever since like I found out it's a trap. It's just that's all that's stuck in our head. Uh, well, here you go. This is the headmistress office. Oh, no, shit. Yes, don't be nervous. She's a really nice lady. I know, I met her before. Oh, right, silly me. You have to see her when you wanted to enroll here. Yeah. Ear. Yeah. Forget the H. Just ear. 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 If you wanted to enroll here, okay. Thank you for everything, Andre. Audrey. No problem. I'll see you later. Yeah, you will. <laughs> uh, I wonder what Headmistress Faro wants. She said it was important for me to see her after I unpacked. Huh? Is there someone else in the side? I can hear yelling. Are they arguing with the Headmistress? Dot 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 so dot 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 mi Mistress showing someone a good time Oh damn She's a mistress alright yeah. <laughs> The arguing stopped I guess I can go in now Excuse me Ah hello Maria That girl She's the one I bumped into earlier Erica Farrow. 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 Could she be related to the headmistress? I didn't even make the connections before. Maria, is something the matter? Did you need to see the headmistress? Yes, she asked me to come to see her after I finished unpacking, but I got lost. I've been trying to find her office for an hour. I apologize for not offering to help. I've been giving directions to new students, but I, it slipped my mind when we met. Ah, oh, jeez. It's okay. I got here in the end with the help of a girl who saw me. How interesting. What did you want to see me for, Miss Farrow? Should I leave? I can keep my eye out for that student. That. I need a drink. That would no longer be required. He has arrived. What? Did he sneak in while we were talking? Show yourself, boy. Yeah, we just ninja ourselves in here. Without <laughs> you seeing us. Not over here. Not over here either. Mav, Miss Farrow, you must have seen where he di where he hid. Ah, he's not hiding at all. He's in plain sight. Lift up this skirt. Is this some kind of riddle? There's nobody here other than you, me, and Maria. Precisely. You're the boy, Erica. <laughs> <laughs> what a twist. She's confused to know that she's the boy. She's never looked down before. No, she's questioning everything. Hell she's yeah. Not really her mother. <laughs> Ma Maria? You're the boy? You're our boy? Y yes, I am. Miss Farrell, you told her? I'm already... Pushing it by letting you attend Maiden's Heart Academy. Hiding your gender from your roommate would be too much. Don't worry, she promised that she won't tell anyone. When my daughter makes a promise, she always keeps it. So, 
There are related. The headmistress never told me that she had a daughter. Two of them. Two of them. Imagine if you could turn into a mother-in-law if we married one of these waifus. Sophia oh. or Erica. Oh no. <laughs> By the way, you two already know each other. It sounds like a little more than a short welcome to the school. What does this rose keep? I have no idea what it is. I think it's just there. We met earlier today after accidentally bumping into each other. She was really nice to me. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know. She told me that I looked like a princess, which made me so happy. Nobody's ever told me that before. <laughs> Show us rap. D don't don't just bring that up so casually. And what kind of guy gets excited about being called a princess? Ben does all the time. <laughs> what, what what did I do? Erica. Listen, you. Okay. Listen, you. Just because you look like that doesn't mean I'll accept you. You're still a boy, and I know what you boys are like. But 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 bullshit. You may have fooled my mother, but you will not fool me. I don't understand. Why is she saying these things? She was so nice earlier. Cause that's what women do. They're nice to you one minute, and then poof, they change. What happened to that girl? Is it really just because she knows I'm a male now? But I need to keep to one pronoun. Rather male, boy, or dude, guy. <sighs> Erica, he's done nothing wrong. Stop trying to accuse him of crimes you're making up in your own lap head. Stop making up assumptions. I should try that whilst reading. I'm assuming what the line's gonna be. I'd hoped you would have given him a chance when I saw you that one I saw that you two met on good terms, but you're not. Um, may I say something? You may. Erica, I can understand why you're hesitant to live with a boy, but I promise you that I won't cause you any trouble. I'll listen to whatever you say and do whatever you ask. Oh, that was a mistake. You never tell a girl that. Make, make, making that sound loud enough. It's not like I have much of a choice anyway. The headmistress has pretty much decided that we're going to become roommates, rooming together. To be rooming together. You still I, I never really friends. heard. You still would have been correct if you just said roommates together anyway. Yeah, but that's not what it says. It says rooming. I know. Finally, I thought I was going to have to threaten to cancel your allowance because you were being so stubborn. Yeah, no pocket money for you. No milk money. No milk money. Good luck in a cafeteria. Give me your milk money. <sighs> you would go that far? If you are unable to help someone in need, then you don't deserve an allowance. Like I'm allowing you to live in my school. <laughs> for now on... There's a nice rent. box around the corner from here. Yeah, you got a piece of rent. Now that the roommate issue has been addressed, it is time for the next topic. I told you before that I want him to fit in, show him around the school, and familiarise him with the his classrooms. Uh, do I have to? Isn't it enough that I'm letting him sleep with me? <laughs> One way to word it. Oh dear. Probably sometimes think before you say something. Yep. S sleep in the same room as me, not sleep with me. Huh? I believe you were the only one 
thinking that way. Yeah, you were. And yes, you have to show him around. You're in charge of looking after him and being there for him when he needs it. So annoying. I, I try not to bother you too much. You'd better. Well, a bitch. Well, that's about wraps it up. Sorry for keeping you here so long, but there was a lot we needed to needed to discuss. As I get tongue-tied on the end there. I don't mind. It's important that I know all the rules. I don't want to accidentally do something that will get me in trouble. It would affect... It would affect you too, and... I don't want to see something bad happen to you just because you let me enroll. You are such a sweet person. Do you have any final questions? Yes. No. <laughs> I've asked all I needed to ask. Then you are both free to go. Have a good night. Good night to you as well. Not even a goodbye. She hasn't been this angry with me in a long time. I hope she opens up to him. They've both been hurt so much in their lives. Backstory, please. I'm going out for a walk. I need some alone time to think things through. M may I come with you? Did you not hear what I just said? I need to be alone. What am I supposed? What am I supposed to do? I want to go back to the dorms, but I don't remember how to get there. Oh God! Hopeless I don't trap. Remember anything? When you're walking. Around. What? Why are you looking at me like that? It's kind. I'm kind of tired. It was very a very long day. Then go back to your R room. And don't you dare touch any of my stuff. Don't you think? Don't think I won't know. I have a good memory when it comes to knowing where I've placed my belongings. I I wouldn't. Good. I'm going. Wait. What is it now? I don't remember where the dawns are. Oh dear. Pain. Pain in the ass right here. Yeah. Low stats. Low strength. Low. Like she's got better strength. But that's why she was like on top of her earlier. Yeah. She was able to lift the bag. Yeah. With one hand. With her pinky. Probably mid intelligence because it's not. He's not very good with directions. I mean, why is he? Why is his plans for the future? Who knows, man. You got lost for an hour, and now you forgot where the dorms are. Your sense of direction is awful. That's what I'm saying. When you leave from the front entrance, go right until you see the sign saying "Dorm C." Cunts. Yeah. Tuesday. What? How do I get out of the school? Oh god, there's normally a big door or an exit sign somewhere. Just How wander works? about until you find the exit. How about that? Use some initiative. Oh my goodness, you have got to be kidding me. Are you that hopeless? Yes. Did I say hopeless earlier? Yes. Good. Called it. Yes. I'm pretty sure we just said yes a second ago. <laughs> Forget it. I'll walk you back to the room myself. Uh, thank you. Yeah, yeah. Ah, the cool summer night breeze feels nice. Exactly why I wanted to go out for a walk. Hold well, on, well, this game. Right yeah, this game is based like in the summer, yet it came out during winter. So, sorry. Is there anything I can do to get on to get you to treat me like you did when we were when we first met? Why are you that desperate for me to call you princess again? 
No, 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 I just want to be... Just want you to be as nice as you were before. Though, I wouldn't mind if you were to also say that I look like a princess again. Well, you can keep wishing that because I will never say it again. Now that I know you're a boy, you are a boy. You shall call me Prince instead. There's no way I can treat you the same no matter what you do. Does that answer your question? Yes. No. Maybe. <laughs> so. I wish I had gotten Audrey as my roommate. Me too. Me three. But then again, maybe she would be the same if she discovered I am a boy. Maybe so, maybe not. We're here. Do you have the path memorized? No. Sort of, maybe, not at all. Well, you remember eventually after repeat walks here throughout the year. As I just stop that there thingy, it's nice. It's a nice dorm. All the other dorms, all the other ones like this. This is actually the best of them. The other dorms don't hold a candle to this. The way this one looks. Wow, that makes me appreciate having a room here. Self-centered girls. You probably would have ended up in another dorm if it wasn't for me. You should feel grateful to me. No, it was your mother. You're <laughs> grateful to your mother, not you. Which we would like to be grateful to your mother. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Had to throw a joke out there somewhere. I am. Thank you, Erica. I flashed her the best smile I can manage. I want to get on her good side. She says there's nothing I can do to change her mind, but I can, can't can just give up. We're roommates, so I want her to like me. I I was joking around. You're making me... Making it seem I was... Like, blah, 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 blah. You're making it seem like I was fishing for that. Thank you. You were, weren't she? Yeah. She's got that horrible attitude. You should be grateful to me. Get on the floor and now lick my feet. <laughs> I am a dominant matrix. <laughs> I, I, <clears throat> I wasn't. Okay. Come on already, let's go inside. Inside? No. Where is everybody? Probably in a, uh, probably in a dining room. Dinner starts in about five minutes. Breakfast and dinner are provided in each individual dorm, and lunch is held in the school cafeteria. It's an interesting way of doing it. It will be more efficient and less costly to do the meals in the school cafeteria, but I think they want to encourage bonding with dorm mates. I didn't know we'd be getting dinner today since school doesn't start until tomorrow. There was breakfast too and lunch at the cafeteria. Are you saying you haven't eat, had anything to eat all day? Stomach growls. How embarrassing. Never let your stomach growl in front of a woman. Uh, heh, that was embarrassing. I take that as a no. You should go get something to before 8 p.m. That's when dinner ends. If you don't, you have to either sleep hungry or satisfy yourself with the snacks from the in the fridge. Got it. I'll go down in a bit. Will you be coming too? I had a big lunch, so I'll pass. Besides, I want to go on that walk I was on so rudely interrupted on from. I was so oh, I was oh so rudely interrupted from. S sorry. Apologize. We needed help. You already apologized. Just supposed to help, and you didn't help. How dare you? Ba ba bitch. Go to the B dorm. <laughs> the, the C dorm is too nice, and 
even though you are the C word. And C words are meant to be useful. Which you have not been, you can go to the B door. What do you want me to say? Nothing. What's done is done. Right. I think I'll call that a video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching my life as a maiden. A trap's tale. Gotta add that in. And I shall see all you guys. We shall see all you guys in the next video. Thank you and bye.